All right, this video is on how to do the running man and then the half running man. So here's the running man. And the half running. And then you can do it both ways. Okay, to begin with, in order to do the running man, I like to compare the running man with jumping rope. And if you can jump rope, you can do the running man. So they're really similar to each other because as you jump rope, you're on the balls of your feet, you know, up on your toes and you're kind of jumping a little bit, you know, but the, the difference between jumping rope and doing the running man is that you're you're alternating your feet whenever you're doing the running man. I would say the main position in the running man where you're grounded is when your front foot is forward and your back foot is backward. You know, like when you're in this position, both feet hit at exactly the same time. But that's what I would recommend doing first. Just pretend like you're jumping rope like that, and then go like this and alternate. Like that. And then the next step would be this middle line right here. This is, this is like a balancing point where at some point you gotta be balancing on one leg. When you're on both legs, you're stable. But whenever you're on one leg, you're balancing. So this is the balancing line right here. So the next step after this one is to just go to the middle with both your feet and then switch your feet and go into this position where one's forward and one's back. Then both of them are together, both of them are apart. Together, apart. Together, apart. Together, apart. Okay, now after that, the next step, instead of just going together, you, you lift the back leg. So as this foot goes to the middle, this one just simply goes up. So you just go like that. And then it's the same thing as before. Both feet hit at the same time and they're separated. So the next thing you do is you bring this foot to the middle and then this one will go up into the middle like that. So both feet are in the middle, but this one is just off the ground. Both are in the middle, but this one's off the ground like that. And you're balancing on one foot and then you go down and you stabilize yourself. You're balancing and then you stabilize yourself on both feet. So that's basically how you do the running man. Okay, a main thing about doing the running man is that you have to do four steps in between the main beat of the music. So what you have to do is just focus on like one foot. Like right here, there's a there's a square right there. I'll just start with my foot here. And what there is, is there's one, two, three, four. So there's four movements in between the main beat of the music. I'll do it at a little quicker pace. One, two, three, four. So like always right here to match your feet to the music, all you have to do is just focus on one foot. It doesn't matter if it's the left foot or if it's the right foot. I put like a little piece of tape here 
you know, and that represents where the beat of the music is if I'm focusing on my right foot. So it's so like right there is where the fourth step is. One, two, three, four. So like that's where the beat of the music is. And that's how you match up the running man to the beat of the music. Okay, in order to do the half running man, what you're doing, like whenever you go into a pool and you're floating, if you start pushing water, what will happen is if you push to the right, your body will start rotating to the left. If you push to the left, your body will start rotating off to the right like that. But if you push with both hands like this way or both hands this way, you, you don't really rotate because they're balancing each other out. You know, both of them are moving apart and together. So it keeps your body centered. Same thing with this. The half running man, what you're doing is this foot's going backwards and then this foot's going forward and then it reverses. This leg comes back to the middle, and then this leg comes back to the middle. So they're going apart and then back together, apart and then back together. So they're, they're balancing each other out. The momentum of each leg balances the other one out. And then same thing if you go backwards, it's like this one is going forward, that one goes backwards. So they just kind of balance each other out. You know, one goes forward to the middle and then this one goes backwards to the middle. Okay, so now you can do the running half running man, you can do it forward and then backwards and then you can combine them. So as this comes to the middle, you know, this leg comes to the middle. As this one goes backwards, this one goes forwards. So I hope that helps you out with the running man and then the half running man and then the the full half running man or whatever you want to call it.